everybody, Rick Ballow with Power Test, uh, bringing you a, a perfect example of our H36 series. This is an H3608. Uh, this dyno was designed for low speed, high torque operation. This dyno is bi rotational. So, with the advantages of our system, is you do not have to rotate the dyno. Uh, uh, you can rotate in either direction, torque is applied in either direction, absolutely no problem. We've got multiple models available anywhere from basically 1,600 horsepower up to 10,000 horsepower in a single dyno. The largest unit that we have is available in, in a 50,000 pound foot torque range, which is a ballpark of 70,000 Newton meters. Basically, this system is designed for use in typical applications of either rail engines, marine engines, uh, very large off-highway applications. Uh, those are typical of, of this and also gensets. So it's, it's typically, it's used, for example, in a CAT version, uh, 3500 or 3600 series engines, typically in a 12 cylinder or larger. Uh, and also C-175, 16s, 20s. This is more than capable dyno for those applications. Uh, in the front of the system is the companion flange, which typically is connected to a drive shaft or carden shaft, which again, is it connected to the flywheel on the engine. Up on the top of the dyno is the water intake. So that is typically fed by uh, uh, a VFD controlled pump system. That is what is uh, feeding the water into the dyno to either increase or decrease the loading requirements. Over here is the load cell, which is used to monitor and measure uh, the actual torque requirements of the engine. This in turn, based on torque and distance uh, and speed, we can calculate power. So it's we are monitoring true torque of the dyno system or the output of the engine and we are calculating power based on speed and, and the torque information. The entire dyno assembly is connected to a sub-base. Sub-base uh, uh, is the discharge system for the dyno, so uh, the water is discharged through the return ports uh, or the exhaust ports into the sub-base. Sub-base has ANSI flanges that will be fed to a gravity drain system, returning back to the water storage reservoir for the cooling tower system. If you need anything in the future relative to sales support, please take a look at our website, www.powertestdyno.com. Feel free to take a look and see if we can find an agent that can help you or one of our sales representatives. Thank you.